Hello everyone and welcome back to Coral Island. My name is Melanie V. It is now Friday the 26th of winter. We only have a few days left in the season. Let's go check out our tree fruit. Do we have anything ready today? Yeah, we got some pears. And we got some more of the cacao. And let's let our little animals out. Come on out, you guys. We'll let the birds out as well. And I think we're gonna stick... Can we put this pier into the keg? Let's see. We certainly can. We can make pure juice. And let's grab some stuff from our mason jars. We really need to get our farm organized. There's just a little bit of everything every which way. We'll put a few things away. Now, pickled kale. We don't need to donate that because we are going to donate the fossil sprouts. Actually, this is better quality. Let's sell that. Uh, eggplant will sell the cheese. We can sell uh, the cacao. This is considered a fruit, so why can't it go into the machines that require fruits? I don't really know. But I think we'll put it in the fridge. Might as well save it. There we are. One thing we needed to put in here was stone. Do we have some set aside? Let's get some stone right here in this chest. I think we can make stone soup. So we'll leave that there for now. And let's care for our little animals. We'll take some hay. And we don't need to shear the sheep today, do we? No, but we do need to get milk from four of our animals. Some from the cow. Some from our goat. And let's not forget to pet them. Gotta keep them happy. And let's get one more goat milk. We'll make sure this guy's doing good too. He certainly is. So, this might be the last time we have to fill our trough with father in here. Because maybe the silo will be ready tomorrow. Okay, and we got some milk we're gonna process. Let's do some goat's milk. Get some more goat cheese. And we'll need to collect our eggs. What is this quail doing? It can fly. I guess so. <laughs> okay, we have just three eggs today. We'll take all of these, of course. Now, should I move my mayo machines over t closer to, to this coop here? I kind of want to, but at the same time, I'm, I'm still planning to move this coop from this spa. That is not its permanent home. Okay, mayo on the go. Um, where did I have the hay? Uh, let's just set it aside here. So one thing we want to do today is get our scythe back. So we are going to head up to see the blacksmith. And get our osmium scythe back. That's going to be amazing. I hope it is going to be amazing. 
And maybe we'll take some stuff over to the goddess too. So we need to take this and this. And we might as well take some geodes and nodes. We'll take the fossil stilling and we only have three geodes. That is so sad. All that work for three geodes. And we might as well pop by the museum too. Okay, it's 10 a.m. So I hope the carpenter shop is open. Over to the woodlands we go. It seems like every time we want to go someplace, that's the day their shop is closed. Do a quick trash check. I don't see anyone at the counter, but <laughs> it's open. We'll take our tool back. We have the osmium site. Very nice. Let's process some geodes. Amethyst from the mystery geode. Bronze ore, not good. Moonstone. I don't think we got one of those. That might be a new one. So the next tool I think we'll upgrade is maybe our axe. Or should we go with our pickaxe next? It's gonna cost us 20,000, so we definitely can't afford it right now. Um, maybe we can upgrade our hoe. Cause this is only gonna take silver and it only costs 3,000. But do I really wanna spend my money on that? It's not like I use the hoe a whole lot. It's pretty rare. Let's head over to the Lake Temple, make a few donations here. So all we need now is a large goat's milk. Okay, hopefully we get that soon. And we can complete another bundle. Artisan... Let's put that in here. So we need fruit juice. We have the pure fruit juice on the go and butter. How do we make butter? So I'm sure we have to use milk and something, but what? It has to be one of the artisan machines, right? Uh, I guess we'll figure it out. Um, we also should try doing some more cooking. I don't think I've seen any of these recipes though. And I'm not really sure how we get more recipes, even. Let's head into town. We'll go up to Ling's lab. Get some geodes process. And maybe we can purchase some shoes today. I'm definitely looking forward to shoes. Uh, process some fossils. Let's see this guy. Brontosaurus' tail, silver ore, Triceratops, 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 Torso, <laughs> uh, a Gallimimus claw, a Velociraptor's leg, Bronze scalp, boring, a Gallimimus' skull, and what do we have here? Velociraptor's tail, Mammoth's Claw, Silver Ore, Stone, no good, and a Velociraptor's Torso, Mammoth's Leg, last one, Velociraptor's Torso, so we got a lot of duplicates, which we can definitely do it out, I guess we can sell them, so it's fine, um, yeah, let's go donate some of these things, hopefully we got a bunch of new items, Pretty sure the moonstone is new. So we'll be donating that. Uh, let's say hello to Alice. Hey Alice. If you're interested in aliens, you should read this book by Professor Kiev. He has interesting theories about ET intelligence. I read it back in the university. Oh. Those aliens are thing in this game too? Well, that is something we need to explore. Okay, what do we have for donating? The Bronto's tail. 
the Triceratops torso. And the Velociraptor's torso, the claw from the mammoth, the Gallimimus' skull, definitely the moonstone, and the lobster. So we are up to 184 donations. And we've gotten a reward, some rope. Okay, you know, something I really needed, but we'll take it. Okay, let's get back to the farm. I'll drop up a few of these things before we head down to the ocean. It feels like it's been forever since we've been in the ocean. Okay, can we put this in here? Yeah, we can. Um, how are we going to make some butter? I don't really know. Oh well, we won't worry about butter for now. I would like to try using some of these Vortexinators in the ocean. So we got a level 1 of Vortexinator. Isn't there something that's better though? Maybe we just unlock the recipe for crafting it. So we got a Vortexinator level 2. Is there a level 3 one? This is level 1. Um, when are we going to unlock level 3? That's probably going to be the best one. Well, obviously it would be. <laughs> um, silver kelp and glass. I'll make like three of those. Let's get the stuff sold off all of our duplicates. And we'll put some stuff into storage. I probably don't need to take my fishing rod with me. Um, I think my uh, bug net was ready today, though. Maybe we should upgrade our fishing pole again. What did we need for that? It was definitely the essence. But did we need five of them? And we needed wood, I think. Let's just take some wood with us, just in case. Hopefully 20 is going to cut it. And we'll head down to the pier. Go over to the beach shack. See what we can do down there. Who's this? It's Nina. Up for a game of volleyball? Um... I don't know where Nina showed up, <laughs> but we just met her randomly at the festival. So I don't know whose family she is. Hey, Sunny. We'll take our net back and we'll upgrade another one. Uh, 5,000. Yeah, I guess we can afford it. Two more days for that. So we got a silver net now. What does it do differently? Um, nothing. <laughs> Maybe it does something. It just doesn't seem to be doing anything to me. And we are gonna head down. Back to the ocean. First time in four days. I've missed you, my ocean. So, let's kind of sort out our backpack a bit more. Um, we'll put this here. We gotta try out these uh, Vortexinators too. I probably didn't need to bring my pickaxe and weapon, but we did. Okay. Let's actually have a look. Oops. Look at the map here. So there is one more coral site up here. There's one down there. And there's a couple more down. Oh, there's lots for us to do. Okay, in that case, let's just get to work. And this Osmium site is nice. 
one swing and these things are destroyed. I love it. Let's see if we can find an activator really fast. Come out, wherever you are. Um, let's catch this thing. I think I've already caught one of these sea anemones, yeah. We'll probably just sell that guy though. He will earn us a few bucks. And we definitely need more money because there's so many things we still need to do. Expensive things too. that activator. There doesn't seem to be any real strategy we can employ to help us find stuff any better. Which is kind of unfortunate. It's completely random, it seems to me anyway. Okay, let's try over here. We got a blockage right here. Hopefully once we heal the next coral side, that will be unblocked. And there we have another sea anemone. Who am I to say no to a sea anemone? We'll take that guy. There's not even very much trash around here. So, might have to go explore a different region. Because this one doesn't seem ready to unlock us yet. Which way shall we go? Oh, we got a coffer. I'll take that. Um... Yeah, maybe let's try heading down to this one, see if we can find the activator for it. I'm not seeing a whole lot of trash. Okay, well, we're getting this out of the way at least. Uh, the roots are completely gone. <laughs> it didn't just retreat, it just completely disappeared. And let's catch another sea anemone. Seriously, where is the activator? Come on out already. I wonder, did we miss one at some point? Gonna go down this way a little bit more. There's a little fishy. What is he doing down here? Who knows? No trash over here. Let's float on over to this side. Trash. Why is there no trash? Oh, we're going down into the depths. Oh, this is the scary spot. So, this is, we need to heal the ocean, but we can go into this cave. I don't think we need to right now. Let's focus on activator. What is this? A holocron shrimp. Yeah, we've already caught one of you. What we need to catch is an activator. And the struggle on this one is real.
Okay, can't get past this point either. Okay, well, we can climb back up this way. Um, there's a couple more over here. Maybe we'll have to explore that region. These other two up here doesn't seem ready to unlock, but there is tons of trash here. So that is a good sign. Okay, well, not much luck so far. And this is not quite the site that we're needing to heal. Maybe let's try going over here a bit more. Any trash down here? Well, we're finding a lot of osmium kelp, and that's good, but not really what we needed. What about over here? This path is blocked too. Well, this is a little bit confusing. Where are we supposed to be going? I'm not finding any activators. There's still tons of sites to heal. This path is also blocked. I'm feeling a little bit lost. Okay, oh, well, let's go back up this way. There was a bit of trash on this side. So maybe we just need to clear that out a bit. And we'll unlock something new. But we've wasted so much of the day and didn't find a single activator. That's not good at all. There's no shortage of forgeables. It's just not what we need, though. Well, let's catch the starfish. The red nub starfish. We've already cleaned out this area. Um. Hmm. Wonder if we can get down here somehow. That was blocked, though. So we need to figure out where it's not blocked and accessible to us right now. Let's catch this guy, a stone crab. Have we had this guy before? I don't know, he doesn't look familiar. Well, there's a bit of trash, but... Still no activator. Okay, we're already up to 57 pieces of kelp of the osmium quality one too. Well, this is not the area we need to clear out. It's pretty clear. Oh, there's some trash up here though. Not a whole lot, but there is some. And you know what? It is late. We need to get back. Let's go ahead and head up. We'll come back to this point tomorrow. Let's see if we can make it home on time. Oh, run, run, run. Do we have time to sell anything? Yeah, we do. Look at our backpack, it's pretty full. Uh, let's just go to bed. And we will call it a day. Did we level anything up today? 
nothing leveled up, but we did earn 3,502 coral coins. And I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.